We are down here in the happy place Yay! with Miss Smith. Now, we were just talking about her, uh, her failure of technology here. This is the clock. My clock! And uh, if those of you may remember a few years ago, we actually uh, retired the clock when it died. We framed it. We put it on the wall. It's hilarious. Now, you said Mr. Tungit came down here the other day to assist you in setting up your digital clock with the time change. Yes, because it was the wrong time. And look, this, this, this. If you look at it, it has all these buttons on the back. And I'm old, and I don't like all these buttons. I want a clock where you just wind your time, and then it's done. So Mr. Tungit had to come to my rescue and set my clock. Mr. Tungit had to come down and press that button on the back that says time set no! and then hour and minute to get it to the right time. <laughs> and then it had the little bell on it, which meant there was an alarm, so he had to take that off too so I wouldn't come in here and the alarm was going off. So see, who wants this when you can have this, this, come look, look. See this on the back of it, you would just rewind the the little dials the hands and it would go to the number that you wanted it to go to you wouldn't have to like push buttons see i'm old and i like the old way <laughs> the reason i came down here was to talk about operation christmas child but when i entered once again miss smith <laughs> strikes with her i can't stand this technology i need your help speech yes! because she can't figure out why her Hotmail account isn't Updated. populate. It's called populating. Populating? Populating. Again, I'm going to say it again. Mia's on the other side of the room. I want to make sure she hears it. Hotmail. Okay. Her Hotmail. Now, there's a couple of email uh, uh, organizations <laughs> that people just don't use anymore. AOL comes to mind, Mia. Does anybody use AOL? No, Mia say no, they do not. Uh, Yahoo. People still use Yahoo, but there's just not many of them. Uh, Hotmail. Miss Smith. Okay, it's we it's need you to and maybe survey. three other people, maybe you and three <laughs> other people in the entire country uh. still use Hotmail, and they probably haven't updated some of their server equipment in the past 20 years, which is why your emails are no longer populating. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take a survey. If you have a Hotmail account, you need to come see me in C4 so I can prove to Mr. Lewis that Hotmail is still the going thing. All right, and the survey's over. No one came. <laughs> Miss Smith is the only one who has a Hotmail. I know one other person in this world who has a Hotmail account, okay? I'm not going to say his name on TV. He knows who he is because during the pandemic, I made fun of him for having a Hotmail account. <laughs> he has to have me or one of the other ministers at our church come help him use, drum roll, Microsoft Word. He can't figure out how to get Microsoft <laughs> Word to zoom in or zoom out or actually get it the way he wants it to look. He still uses a Hotmail account. Okay. Do you know what a blog is? Uh, sort of. That's where you talk <laughs> to other people. <laughs> Do you know what a vlog is? No, I have no idea. It's a video blog. We're vlogging right now. Oh, we're vlogging! See, I am up to date, man. <laughs> <laughs> Teachers... Please email me if you have a Hotmail account because we're going to call you out on it. See, they're not going to do it after I oh, say no, we take no. this. I need you. I need you on my side. Please email him. There's probably I'm only a handful of... There may be a handful of teachers in this building that have a Hotmail account. Okay. Here's Who are you? Mr. Tice, okay. do you still have a Hotmail account? But here's the thing. If you do have a Hotmail account, I need you to come help me because mine is not populating. <laughs> Nobody in this building has a Hotmail account. Mr. Tice, I'm sorry for calling you out. We know you don't have a Hotmail account anymore. I bet he Nobody, does. I bet he doesn't. Nobody has a Hotmail account. Anymore. People don't use it. We're going to have an episode on EVTV where we teach Miss Smith. Actually, I'm going to let Mia do it. I'm just going to make her. Mia is going to teach Miss Smith how to use Google. Have you heard of the company Google? Yes, Google. Do I need one of those? You need... <laughs> 
You need one of those. <laughs> Miss Smith needs a Google. We call it Gmail. Google's product line for email is Gmail, Google Mail. We just um. we just say Gmail for short. So it's not a Google, it's a Gmail account. Is it safe? <laughs> <laughs> I can't even I can't even right now, Mia. I normally keep a pretty straight face, but I can't even. I can't even. Is it is it safe? Let me tell you what's not safe. Hotmail. They let through so much spam. It is absolutely ridiculous. Do you not get a bunch of letters from India saying, "Hey, we have some money to send you." Yes, Could but you? I never click on those. Never ever. A Google, a Google, <laughs> gets rid of all of that. Like Google, and and some. And I would never see it then. Well, maybe I do need a Google account, but she I needs a Google. Find her. But in the meantime, I have a Hotmail account and it needs some assistance. <laughs> It's gone. Hotmail's gone. No, it's not. It still works. It's gone. We're okay. We're gonna. Uh, we'll paste your last email that you actually got. <laughs> we're gonna print it out and we're gonna frame it and we're gonna put it right next to Tom here. Here's Tom. We're gonna put her last email, Betty, <laughs> in a black frame right here. The end of Hotmail for Miss Wendy Smith. Ah, uh, it was from Shop Disney because you know you can go to Disney World and go shopping. We both, Mr. Lewis and I both love Disney. <laughs> she knows the truth. Disney is not one of my happiest places on earth. It is the happiest place on earth. Don't listen to him. Disney's not the happiest place on earth. <laughs> this is a conversation for another time. In the meantime, I need hotmail help.